Have you ever wondered how an invisible adversary once paralyzed the world not just physically but with fear? Welcome to the historical journey of polio. This ancient terror emerged across civilizations, leaving an indelible mark on humanity. Its insidious reach was often met with misunderstanding. From the sands of antiquity beliefs varied, deeming it a divine punishment, a product of malevolent spirits or a consequence of miasmas swirling in the air. The mystique of polio lingered obscured by a veil of uncertainty. As the centuries unfolded societies grappled with the unknown. Polio, an invisible adversary, cast its ominous shadow far and wide. Quarantine signs became an all-too-familiar sight, dotting the landscape with reminders of a relentless foe. The iron lung, a chilling symbol of the disease's grip, marked the line between life and breath. Communities trembled, anticipating the unseen onslaught. The specter of polio infiltrated every home, every family. The monster was faceless, but its presence was palpable. Families lived in dread of polio's shadow. But in the face of darkness a spark ignited, the flame of scientific inquiry. As fear and uncertainty gripped the world, intrepid minds dared to challenge the unknown. The enigma of polio once shrouded in superstition and fear began to unravel under the scrutiny of science. Renowned pioneers like Jonas Salk and Albert Sabin stepped into the fray, their relentless pursuit of knowledge paving the way for a deeper understanding of this insidious disease. Armed with this newfound knowledge humanity shifted from a state of helpless dread to one of informed action. The grim specter of polio was no longer an invincible foe but a conquerable adversary. Their invaluable contributions, their unwavering dedication, became our beacon in the dark, illuminating the path towards a polio-free world. This is a testament to humanity's resilience and our relentless pursuit of knowledge. From ancient misconceptions to modern understanding we've come a long way in the battle against polio. Have you ever wondered how ancient civilizations grappled with diseases they couldn't understand? Polio virus, one of the most feared and misunderstood diseases of the past, has a history that stretches back thousands of years. Our journey begins in ancient Greece, where the legendary physician Hippocrates first described the disease. In his writings he referred to it as infantile paralysis, a nod to its propensity to impact the young. His detailed accounts of muscle weakness paralysis and diminished reflexes offered the world its first glimpse into the clinical features of polio. Beware the creeping palsy that strikes the young and takes their strength away. Avicenna, Persian physician, 980, 1037. This quote reflects the fear and uncertainty that surrounded polio in medieval times. Avicenna, a renowned physician and philosopher, observed the debilitating effects of the disease on children and warned others of its insidious nature. The child was struck down by a cruel hand, his limbs weakened and withered. Hildegard of Bingen, German abbess and polymath, 1098-1179. This quote, penned by the visionary Hildegard of Bingen, paints a vivid picture of the devastating impact of polio on children. Her use of the phrase cruel hand suggests the belief that the disease was caused by an external force, possibly divine punishment or evil spirits. The people were stricken with a mysterious ailment, their limbs trembling and their bodies wasting away. Anonymous Medieval Chronicle, 1348. This quote from an anonymous medieval chronicle. As we journey through time, the spectre of polio continued to loom large. Medieval medical texts like Avicenna's Canon of Medicine echoed Hippocrates' observations. While the understanding of the disease was limited, these texts proposed remedies to alleviate the suffering of those afflicted. Fast forward to the Middle Ages, a period rife with superstition and folklore. In the absence of scientific understanding, polio was often attributed to divine retribution or the influence of evil spirits. The disease was even linked to miasmas, believed to be harmful vapors rising from decaying matter. But amidst these misconceptions, there was also a profound sense of compassion. Charitable institutions and religious orders provided solace, shelter and support for polio victims, demonstrating the enduring human spirit in the face of adversity. In conclusion, the history of polio virus is a testament to humanity's struggle with disease and the relentless pursuit of understanding. From the early descriptions in ancient Greece to the misconceptions and compassion of the Middle Ages, the story of polio is one of resilience and progress. It serves as a reminder of how far we've come and the challenges we've overcome in our quest to conquer disease. 
The early 20th century witnessed a relentless pursuit to unravel the mysteries of polio, a crippling and often fatal disease that cast a long shadow over humanity. The discovery of polio virus in 1909 by Viennese scientists Carl Landsteiner and Erwin Popper marked a turning point, but the path to understanding and combating this formidable foe was fraught with challenges. Landsteiner, renowned for his groundbreaking work in immunology, and Popper, a pioneer in experimental pediatrics, embarked on a meticulous journey to isolate the polio virus. Their quest was not without its hurdles. The virus proved elusive, hiding within the central nervous system of infected individuals, making it difficult to cultivate in the laboratory. The search for the polio virus was like chasing a phantom. It was an invisible enemy, leaving behind a trail of devastation, yet remaining hidden from our direct observation. Despite the challenges, Landsteiner and Popper persevered, employing innovative techniques to isolate the virus from monkeys, which exhibited similar symptoms to those in humans. Their breakthrough discovery in 1909 provided a tangible target for scientific research, opening new avenues for understanding and combating polio. The discovery of polio virus ignited a fervent pursuit of a vaccine but the path was far from smooth. Early researchers faced numerous obstacles including the difficulty of cultivating the virus in large quantities for vaccine production and the lack of animal models that could accurately replicate the human disease. Quote from Jonas Salk, the development of a polio vaccine was a daunting task. We were facing a formidable virus, one that had caused widespread fear and suffering for centuries. The stakes were high and the challenges were immense. Undeterred by these obstacles, scientists around the globe tirelessly pursued a vaccine, driven by the urgency to alleviate human suffering and halt the scourge of polio. In 1949, American virologist Jonas Salk made a significant breakthrough with the development of the inactivated polio virus vaccine, IPV, also known as the Salk vaccine. The Salk vaccine, administered via injection, offered a beacon of hope in the fight against polio. Clinical trials demonstrated its effectiveness in preventing paralytic polio, and its widespread adoption in the 1950s led to a dramatic decline in polio cases worldwide. Quote from Jonas Salk, the development of the Salk vaccine was a triumph of science but it was also a testament to human perseverance. We faced numerous challenges but we never gave up. We were determined to find a way to protect children from this devastating disease. However, the Salk vaccine was not without its limitations. Its administration via injection was less convenient than an oral vaccine, and it required multiple doses to achieve full immunity. This paved the way for the development of the oral polio vaccine, OPV, by American virologist Albert Sabin in the late 1950s. The discovery of polio virus and the development of effective vaccines represent significant milestones in the fight against this once dreaded disease. These vaccines along with global immunization campaigns have played a crucial role in reducing polio cases by over 99% worldwide. While the story of polio virus isolation and vaccine development is one of triumph, it is also a reminder of the challenges and limitations faced in the early 20th century. These challenges highlight the importance of scientific research and collaboration in addressing global health threats. While the development of polio vaccines represents a triumph of science, the question of vaccine patents and their impact on global health access remains a critical issue demanding careful consideration and nuanced solutions. In fact, Jonas Salk, the inventor of the Salk vaccine, famously declared, a quote emphasizing that scientific breakthroughs should not be confined by the limitations of intellectual property rights.